So here we are at uh, Thomas Craven's studio, and we're going to look at how he's producing this uh, gold look, this gold effect. Over to you, Tom. Well, this is an antique gold uh, paint finish that we've uh, been commissioned by a, a customer to do. Uh, and it's basically black paint uh, with gold uh, uh, powder stippled over the top of that and then clear finish over the top. So we're using the Ellis uh, black uh, polyester primer surfacer and everything is painted first. And I can show you a door real quick. Here's a door that's been painted with with the black primer and then just red padded back. That's all we do with that. Just red padded back to, to prepare the surface for the gold that goes on over the top of it. And then the next step is the application of the gold. And this is gold powder, crest light powder that's been uh, uh, embedded. We use as the vehicle the Ellis brand um, clear polyester uh, undercoat or sanding seal. And uh, we use that at, almost as the glue medium for the material. So the powder goes into the catalyzed polyester and then, in this case, stippled and ragged on with natural sea, sea sponges and brushes. Great. And then at the end of it, we, you apply, we apply the clear. What kind of clear are you applying? Well, this, this, this client... Uh, just preferred, I made him a sample of the fully filled polyester resin and, and unpolished and polished here. But he actually chose, this customer actually chose and, and liked the satin sheen the best. Right. I so like that's, that one. That's what we're ending up with. That's the final finish. Great. Satin sheen conversion varnish.